Can Russia really see America's stealth aircraft? Russia claims it can. Moscow has repeatedly stated that its advanced air defense systems, the S-400 and the next-generation S-500 Prometi, are capable of detecting and countering America's most secretive aircraft, the F-22 Raptor, F-35 Lightning II, B-2 Spirit, and the future B-21 Raider. According to Russian officials, the S-500 can detect aerial targets at distances of up to 370 miles, track multiple threats simultaneously, and intercept as many as 10 hypersonic or supersonic missiles flying at extreme speeds. If true, these capabilities would represent a major leap in air defense technology and a direct challenge to decades of U.S. stealth dominance. But in modern warfare, what matters is not what is claimed, but what can be proven. What stealth really means. Stealth does not mean invisibility. It means delay, distortion, and denial. Aircraft like the F-22, F-35, B-2, and B-21 are designed to reduce detection across multiple spectrums, radar, infrared, acoustic, and electronic. The goal is not to disappear, but to shrink detection ranges so drastically that enemy defenses have little time to react. This is where Russia's claims meet physics. F-22 Raptor – Stealth Built for Air Superiority The F-22 Raptor remains the most stealth-optimized air-to-air fighter ever deployed. Its radar cross-section is extremely small from multiple angles, not just the front, and its stealth is deeply integrated into the aircraft's structure, not added as an afterthought. Even if a system like the S-400 or S-500 were to detect a faint return at long range, detection alone does not equal targeting. To engage the F-22, a radar must maintain a continuous high-quality tracking lock, guide a missile, and survive electronic attack, all while the Raptor is actively maneuvering, jamming, and striking back. F-35 – Stealth plus Information Dominance The F-35 takes a different approach. While not as aerodynamically stealthy as the F-22, it compensates through sensor fusion, electronic warfare, and networked combat. The F-35 does not fight alone. It fights as part of a digital ecosystem, sharing targeting data with ships, satellites, ground units, and other aircraft. If detected, the F-35 is designed to detect back faster, disrupt enemy radar, and cue long-range strikes without exposing itself. In short, seeing an F-35 does not mean surviving it. B-2 Spirit – The Original Stealth Bomber The B-2 Spirit was built for one mission, penetrating the most heavily defended airspace on Earth. Its flying wing design minimizes radar returns across a wide range of frequencies, including lower bands often cited by Russian analysts as stealth killers. Despite being over 30 years old, the B-2 remains operational precisely because it has been continuously upgraded, especially in electronic warfare and mission planning. No air defense system has ever successfully engaged one in combat. B-21 Raider – Designed for the S-500 Era The B-21 Raider was designed with systems like the S-400 and S-500 in mind. Unlike earlier stealth aircraft, it incorporates next-generation materials, adaptive signatures, and deep integration with cyber and electronic warfare from the outset. The B-21's true capabilities remain classified, but U.S. defense officials have made one point clear. It is intended to operate inside highly contested, sensor-dense environments, even against modern integrated air defense systems. The Strategic Reality Russia's announcement that it may export the S-500 to China and India is not just military, it is geopolitical. If deployed in the Indo-Pacific, such systems could complicate U.S. and allied air operations and strengthen Russia-China military alignment. But complexity does not equal denial. 
air defense systems do not operate in isolation. They rely on radars, communications, command centers, and power infrastructure, all of which are vulnerable to disruption, cyber attack, and precision strike. Stealth aircraft are not designed to defeat missiles. They are designed to collapse the system before the missile is ever launched. Russia claims its air defenses can see America's stealth aircraft. The United States designs its stealth aircraft assuming they will be seen eventually. The difference lies in timing. In modern warfare, the side that sees first, decides first, and strikes first does not need perfect invisibility, only enough advantage to act while the enemy is still reacting. And that remains the core purpose of stealth.